Today we'll be doing sponge painting. I have already some of our paintings that I will be showing you. Uh, we'll be using primary colors which is red, blue, and yellow. I have already cut out uh, the sponges into shapes like rectangle, a circle, and a triangle. Uh, we have mixed some of them just for the lesson. Um, when you mix purple, I mean when you mix blue and red, you make purple. And when you mix yellow, yellow and red, you make orange. When you mix yeah, red and blue, you make green. Um, I will let the kids do a drawing with a flower or they could do just uh, dip the sponges and, and just put the shapes all over their paper or they can be creative and do a, a pumpkin, whatever they want to do. So I would start with showing them the pictures first just to, so they can get an idea of what we're going to do today. Then I would start one and I will start with the yellow and I would, I already have the sponges and the paint so I'm going to dip the sponge, press the sponge on the paper to create a sun. It doesn't have to be perfect. Then I would ask them what shape is this and they would be able to tell me a circle. Then we would use one of our rectangle ones and I would use the one that is orange. So then again, just letting them be creative and uh, making a picture of whatever they want. So like here, I, we have made a sun. And then I will show them that if they don't want to make a, a, a picture of something, then they can just use all our shapes that we already have cut out and just dip the sponge in the paint and press it all over the paper and then just play with the shapes and see what they can create with the paint and using the sponges. This will encourage children to be more creative and learn how to use and be able to name their shapes. Now we're going to use this one. We're going to dip it in the purple and just let them get a little bit messy so that way they have a little bit of fun. And I have uh, put the clean sponges here so they'll be able to grab them. And I would provide plates and I also have the knife. So when if they want to help me, I would ask some helpers to help me mix the colors before they would go to the tables. So that's it for our sponge box.